If you're tuning in right now, you happen to be watching the world's truest source for hip-hop news, black culture, sports, and of course the best reaction videos on the net. I'm talking about Kofi's Universe. If you haven't already subscribed, it's your chance to hit that button now before I hit this blunt. Bada. YouTube salute. Hitler wears Hermes 10. Final installment of this run West Side Gun has been on with HWH, y'all. Let's talk about the album. If you're new to my channel, thumbs up the video. Hit the subscribe button, click that bell icon to be notified when I upload new content and go live. So before, this was supposed to be called The Shell Records. But I guess he changed it at the end. Hitler, Hitler wears Hermes 10. Just wanted to let y'all know. But um, let's get into the features. We have the Griselda Camp, Armani Caesar, Benny the Butcher, Conway the Machine, we got Jay Wordy. We have Rome Street, Stove God Cooks, West Side Pootie. <laughs> Outside features Run the Jewels. Yep, you heard I said. We have Raekwon, Ghostface, Buster Rhymes, DJ Drama, Brother AA Rashid on the intro. And as far as producers, we got Conductor. We have a problem. Conductor, we have a problem. Um, Uncle Al, The Alchemist. Denny LaFlair, Elijah Hooks, Fly Guy Jr., which is West Side's son, Mike Shab, Pete Rock, Resurrecta, and Swizzy, Swiss Beats, y'all. So, how many tracks? 12 tracks, just to let y'all know. The duration of the album is 49 minutes and 48 seconds. So, what are some things that stood out about this album? Number one, production wise. Production wise is great. You know, you have a plethora of dope producers so i was very proud of that of you know getting some great production you know the, the guest appearances unbelievable unbelievable let's start off with the last track red death that track is 10 minutes and 10 seconds you have everybody on there conway Westside, benny marty caesars stove god jay wordy um from streets they all on that track they all have like a minute <laughs> and some change on for their verse, so they're they're dropping bars. So just check that out and get a chance. Science class, oh my God, RZA did his um excuse me not RZA, Swiss Beats made that beat. Um, he did a great job. You know, Ray Ghost. You know, you got Stove God on there at the end. Busta, they did their job. It reminds me of this seventies type of um Black Connection type of um just vibe. You know, and it's real dope, almost like that black exploitation type of, you know, vibe. Peppers featuring Talib Kweli, Yasin Bey, aka Black Star together. <sighs> Bars. And if you haven't checked out Black Star new album, man, this is why, you know, everybody anticipated Black Star for dropping another album because we know, you know, what they talk about, you know, the rhyme style, you know, the rhyme scheme, lyricism. Um, the conscious uh, metaphors, everything's just flowing together. So this was a real dope track right here. I like ASAP Rocky and Stove God Cooks on shootouts. That was dope right there. I was actually impressed with that. Um, the beat, the beat was real, real dope. And another track that I think you should check out is BDP. It has that, this is how we do it, Sambo. Rome Streets and Stove God Cooks. Put they bars down so everybody can know. <laughs> I'm just being, I'm just being silly. Um, so guess empiricists, I give that like a nine because I was very impressed with that. Production wise, I give that a, a solid eight. I give it a solid eight. Performances, I wanted West Side Gun to actually rap a little more. He only had one track by himself. I wanted to maybe have four tracks with him by himself. So um that's like, you know, something I took some points off you know this is me critiquing him i wanted to hear some more dj drama that's some of the points i took off he was on here a few times but i wanted more um what else did i like or i disliked about the album um i think that was more just i wanted to hear more west side by himself but even though 
everybody else filled in, made an ice album. I mean, you know how West Side Gun albums are. You already know how they are. See, I got to critique something. So when it comes to creativity, creativity, I give it a solid seven point. I said production a nine. Yes, and Pierce's. I, I mean, production of eight. Yes, and Pierce's a nine. Um, overall, the album is about a 7.7 .7 out of 10. I think it's a solid, what, B minus? Yeah, B, B minus, whatever. That's how I grade it, 7.7 .7 out of 10, B, B minus. I want you to check it out on all digital streaming platforms. And um, yeah, y'all let me know what you think. Post your comments below. Post smash Black Panther the like button. Subscribe to my channel. Click the bell icon to be notified when I upload new content and go live. If you want to support and donate to the channel, I have Patreon at patreon.com slash universe. Venmo, Cash App, PayPal, Streamlabs, everything's in the description. Until next time, salute.